Okay, this is what I've worked on for the capture of the flag. This is the entire system that the entire system that will allow a character to pick up the flag. If they die, it will drop the flag and the flag will be teleported back. Um, any command block that is purple is, except for uh, these ones and these ones, uh, are all only to add scoreboards, add people to teams, uh, create the teams, and just to summon and stuff. Now, these will look a little glitchy, but I know for a fact that if two people were actually on, these would work. It's just that since there's not another person on, the red one might not, the red or blue one, whichever one, uh, might not look like it's going to the right place, but it is. As you can see, the blue moved, the red didn't. That's because of uh, some commands uh, here that actually I should change up. Okay, that one's all good now. There's a reason that one's shooting up into the air. Uh, if there was a person on the red team, you could see that one would stay up, that one stay down. So as long as there's two people on, they will both stay where they need to be. Uh, of course, they don't have to be right next to their command block. Wherever the 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 podi podium, it's just a P. Well, wherever this will be is where we'll just change these commands to. But right now, I'm on the red team, and I'm like, oh, I'm gonna go over. I captured the blue. So now, oops. The blue one is over me. It will follow me around. You can see it through walls because it's got the name tag and they will be able to see my name tag. I can add a command that says, oh, this person has it. If I don't want it anymore, I can reset capture by going on this. The only reason it shoots up into the sky is because I'm not on the blue team. Otherwise, it would teleport right back to where it needs to be. Same for the red team. If I press this, it teleports right above me all nice and dandy and if I slash kill myself you can see it disappears and of course yet again if I was on the red team it will teleport back to where it needs to be so that is that system um, it all works great I have signs on all these telling uh, what does what and yeah, I will continue to work on other scoreboard and scoreboard stuff for a capture the flag, including uh, if someone gets close to someone else's podium. Um, and more, um, what was it? I need to remember the name. What was the name? The name was structure blocks, yes. Uh, which actually I'm going to show you here now. I can do that because I have that. So this was the structure block testing world that I created. Once it loads, there it goes. So this space outlined here would be any place for any redstone at all that we could uh, place down. These would be the different quadrants of things. I've tested out uh, redstone stuff in it, see how that works, uh, entities. Obviously we can put these next to each other. I just separated them so I could see them more clearly. And what would happen is we'd make a level, we'd save it, it would say, oh, it's done saving. And then we'd put all the structure blocks in here and then do only two commands per structure block to summon them in, I press the button. Although these were the same, but it would spawn just like this would. This structure block, which is redstone space, actually you can spawn in anytime. It works literally anywhere. I'm just gonna fly super far away so it doesn't break whatever's over there. Um, let's say. This should be far enough away. So if I place this down 
and I click load right stone, I believe I called it space. That's not how you spell space. Space. Load it in. Let's do another one. I'll go load. And it would spawn in this. The only thing we would have to do is press this button. It does take a little bit because it, it's a little laggy, but it then loads in all three. Normally this would happen really quick, but because of the lag, it loads in quite slow. But as you can see, it is the exact same thing over there. From what I've seen, all the redstone all works. Uh, entities work. Things inside of things work. Just a bunch of sheep in here now. And the last thing I could show you is um, I had said on the Discord that uh, we could make a level where lightning will spawn randomly. This is just a very simple command. It just summons lightning at a random armor stand. So if I placed a bunch down, a random armor stand will be struck, and so on and so on. That's just very simple. And that is actually all I have to show you. Um, for those of you watching this on my channel, you're probably like, who in the world is he talking to? But for the people who know who I'm talking to, uh, if you have any other things you want me to build, um, just say it in the Discord. I'll get that done. And yeah. Thanks.